Before we start today's show, happy Tuesday, Wednesday, by the, Tuesday, Wednesday, by the way. <laughs> Sometimes the brother gets messed up. But before we start the show, let's address some comments. Address some comments, yeah. And here we go. I hear you loud and clear. I hear you. Why thank you, my brother? I hear you loud and clear. I hear you You suckers. And it's also National Frappe Day. You know what a frappe is. Really? Not really my cup of tea. <laughs> Get it? Not my cup of tea. <laughs> now, let me address, as always, when there is some. The Libras. I know. Now today happens to be a very special shout out of birthdays. And let me do this the right way. First of all, I want to say happy born day to Dylan Tierney. What's up, Dylan? Old school buddy of mine. I want to say what's up to Brian O'Ross. Happy birthday, Brian O'Ross. And last but never leastly, my right hand man, my left hand, man, the hand with the brass knuckles, DJ JB though. What's up, Johnny? Happy birthday, JB. Happy birthday, JB1. Bridgeport's favorite son. You know what time it is. Here are the gifts. I wanna wanna wish you a happy birthday. I wanna wanna help you celebrate I wanna wanna wish you lots of presents I wanna wanna help you eat your cake Yo, did you know I was giving a hundred dollars away? I bet y'all ass didn't. So yes, I'm giving a hundred dollars away. And how do I do that, you ask? Mind your goddamn business. <laughs> All you gotta do is go right here to my site. When you get to my site, you'll notice along the top, there will be a tab called the contest. Go to the contest or click the contest tab follow the directions. I know you're not that much of an idiot. I call you suckers, I know that, but I know you're not that much of an idiot. Go on, bring your ass on down and see what you can get into. Why not? Thanks for your support. <laughs> you sucker. <laughs> get into the bullshit that goes on in the media. But look at this. An Atlanta man gets a selfie and his friends fire by mocking a black child in racist Facebook selfie, right? So apparently this guy works for a big name company, puts in a picture of him with this kid in the background, right? <laughs> and then here comes the comments. I didn't know you were a slave owner. Help feed this poor child today. 
bla 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 bla. What are your thoughts on this? I'm sorry if I'm fucking up your vibe today. I just wanted to address this because um, every now and then I think I should do that. What are your thoughts on that? I mean, a man who figures that he's doing something like just taking a basic picture and and then all of a sudden all his friends are coming in and chiming in and saying all sorts of racist comments. And then the company goes and fires him. And then the other companies that are affiliated with the people who made comments, those people got fired. Should they have gotten fired? What a boo. So if you're a true inky at and you know my history, then you know that recently I have been divorced. How white people tell their kids they're getting divorced. Todd, I sat you down to let you know that me and your mom, we both love you. We do love you, dear. Something's going on here and I don't like it. I'll kill grandma, I swear. There's no need to kill your grandmother. Me and your mom is going apart. That happens. How Jamaican parents tell their kids they're getting divorced? Poochie, me no business. Me no business neither. What are you? You see the tree are growing on my face? Me I'll pack up my things and cut. It's all good. Daniel, your father I left after me give him 20 years out of my life. But don't worry, we're going to clean him out. How Trinidadians tell their kids they're getting divorced? You always on my case and I don't want no parts of that again. Let me just done it now. What? Don't threaten me with a good time, boy. You speeding, boy. You know bricks? I pack my things in no girl. Who oh, good? Let me help you. Know? When Junior come, tell him I go up. How Guyanese parents tell their kids they're getting divorced. Me bag pack already, girl. Just come and collect me. Is where you think you're going, girl? I leave in you. Siobhan, come and collect me, please. Oh, that's if you want to leave, you can leave in you know? Just make sure and tell your son you got man in the road. He's a whore. Don't like him. How Grenadians tell their kids they're getting divorced. Let me tell you something. It don't matter what you say or how you say. I leave in you. You always accusing me. You're too stupid. Don't talk shit. Give me this year. Just paved road. The other day the road paved already. You taking man? What's going on? Are you mother taking man? How Bayesian parents tell their kids they're getting divorced. Michael. Yes, mommy. Tell him. Tell him you're leaving. Leave Michael out of this. That is your child. Tell him you're leaving because I refuse to take it in the boxy. Yes. And your attitude sucks more than your mouth. How Haitian parents tell their kids they're getting divorced. I'm telling you, you need to pack your bags and leave, okay? Because this relationship is no good. I'm not going nowhere, okay? Because my name is on their deed, your name is on their deed. We live together. What's going on? Go back in your room because I'm not leaving, okay? How African parents tell their kids they're getting divorced. Adola, I feel it would be better if we were part ways because I am not happy, oh. Hey, welcome to the American lifestyle where you can walk the street. and mom will compliment your shape and you will leave me. I cannot do it. Go and cook. How Spanish parents tell their kids they're getting divorced. Hector, you don't have to bother me. I just don't want to be with you no more, okay? Why you keep bothering me, God? Get together. Do you want to break up? That's fine, but I don't moving. I'm going to call my brother. You can call your brother. He can live here with my kids, but I don't move. <laughs> Yo, I love that dude, man. I love that dude right there. So, I didn't have to do all that. Tell my kids, you know you know, I didn't have to do all that. But yeah, I, I am divorced. And I'm not saying that because I'm out here looking for anything because I'm not. Trust. I, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. But I just, wanted to, I, I just wanted to use that as a segue to get into that last skit. And with that, happy hump day, you suckers. Happy Woman Crush Wednesday, you suckers. Yeah, I think my Woman Crush Wednesday is usually the quota, so I'm good. Um, happy payday Eve, Eve. Peace to you, Inky Addicts. Later. This concludes the broadcast concludes from the broadcast. World Control. Do you believe that pretend like this never happened?
Look, I don't like having to trust anyone because I'm always disappointed. But just once, I'd like to know that I could actually trust someone. That for at least.